The state auditor pointing the finger at Senate leaders, accusing them of retaliating against her. But retaliation is still uh, a theme in Senate leadership. It needs to stop. She says they're using the power of their purse strings to get back at her for auditing the legislature. You believe that this is as a result of your efforts to audit the state legislature? Without question without question. This year, the House and governor set aside millions more in funding than last year for the auditor's office, but the Senate's budget remains almost unchanged. Funding the office at the previous year's funding without even accounting for cost of living adjustments or inflation uh, is a cut to our office. A spokesperson for Senate Ways and Means says while hundreds of accounts were level funded, the auditor's office received a more than $300,000 increase in funding from the previous fiscal year. But Desoglio says that money already had been promised publicly to the previous auditor for information technology. Working families are fed up with their tax dollars being used to settle political scores and to play political games. Legislative leaders have said they don't believe Desoglio has the authority to audit their branches. She says she's plowing ahead and believes her staff deserves a boost. We will continue to conduct this audit in the face of retaliation. Now, the Senate Ways and Means spokesperson says increases are weighed on their merits. Desoglio is urging voters to call their state senators and sound off about this and urge them to properly fund her office. We're